New offense, fast tempo. I, I am very proud that they went hard today. Especially the quarterbacks. Offensive coordinator Robert Anai returns with the new offense and is looking for the best player to run it. Well, we're coming into a year without a bona fide starter returning, so it's open. All positions are open. The new offensive staff hopes that this year will bring an undisputed starter. Last year, three quarterbacks started, Riley Nelson, James Lark, and Taysom Hill. Hill played as a freshman last year in six games before a knee injury ended his season. The doctors are hesitant in letting me get to 100% full sprint, and so I've kind of limited myself in that way. But for the most part, I've, I've been able to do everything in 100%. You know, he handled it pretty well, um, and I think uh, it might lead us to be no pads more just for the sake of, of developing a quarterback. He says he feels really good and, and he looks good. I mean, there's nothing too noticeable. It's just a matter of not letting him reach that top end when he's running with the football. Hill does like to run, but also completed 59% of his passes last year. He said the job is his to lose. Yeah, I think so. Um, you know, the, the coaches um, have told us that they're coming in with a clean slate and everybody has an opportunity and things. And um, But I felt good with the time that I've had off from the injury and with my knee and everything felt really good today. Senior Jason Munns is the biggest in the group at 6'5", 250 pounds. He considers himself a dual threat as well and hopes this is his year. You know, I, I, th I think you have to view yourself as a starter. I think if you start viewing yourself as something less, you're going to perform less. And so I would... I would hope that every quarterback and every lineman and receiver is out there with the mentality of starting. Former Alta High School and Southern Utah quarterback Ammon Olsen earned valuable reps running BYU scout team last year against the Cougars' great defense. Just go and be a leader out there and show, them, show the team that you're willing to work and you're willing to put everything into it. I think that's, I think that's a big part of spring football. Bronco Mendenhall says he plans on getting Tanner Mangum in the mix, despite the fact the Elite 11 quarterback plans on going on an LDS mission before fall camp. And with Snow College transfer Christian Stewart and freshman Billy Green, there are plenty of players to evaluate, even if it takes longer than spring camp. Yeah, I mean, you hope you have one guy that plays well and is healthy and he starts every game for you. That's what you want. But for the other guys, I mean, they just got to keep battling and know when an opportunity comes that they need to be ready to make the most of it. For BYU TV, I'm Kathy Aiken.